headset to Windows 8. Um, I just bought a new headset and I just wanted to show you this uh, purely because I was looking for this myself. Um, you need to go to the control panel. This one throws this out. And what you're looking for is to get to the main add devices which let's have a look devices and printers that's what we want just add another one because the problem you got is the, the headphones are wireless so they don't come with software they don't have much help on how to connect up um, and if your Windows 8 is a little bit different to mine it's uh, because I use a shell to actually give it a Windows 7 look but oh, let me switch the headphones on now you want to switch the headphones on and it should beep just to say it's alive um, and there we go there's my new headset click a quick next now it'll talk to my headset it's now having a think After it's pulling these files off the internet, so it's this speed. I am is obviously restricted by whatever websites being um, holding these files because I'm on an 80 meg connection. It should literally only take a few seconds because um, I wouldn't expect the file to be any more than maybe 40 megabyte. It's getting there though. It does remind me to uh, clean up my desktop as well. Got some stuff on here. I can go now. Just wait for this to install. There we go. Yeah. I was going to, I was getting to the point where I was going to say, well, that basically just install and press OK, but it's actually going to finish it. I hope um, quite quite quickly. It's almost there. Okay, it's too slow. Yeah, sorry for the delay, but basically let it install. It will go okay, and it should auto automatically select your headset, and that should you be ready to go. So that's gonna that's gonna say running. There you go. It's already got it. So my headset's now. It, as you can see there set up in progress but it's found it it's up and running um, and I don't see why you should have to sit and watch my video for any longer uh, so thanks for watching